I don't know if the crowd would want to see that after tonight. Ooh. The, the casual fan. The tonight fight for me, I like it. Because you had two sharpshooters, they were strategic. It's not always going to be that rock and stock, you know what I mean? Was, to me, they was two sharpshooters, they were thinking, they was, you know, real strategic. And then um, it was like, almost like the Mongols versus the Cobra. And it, Shakur being and the Mongols, you know what I mean? He mm -hmm. acted out with the jab. Um, Santos just couldn't get off, you know what I mean? Right. He had moments they just didn't they give him any credit. He landed his hook a couple of times. He was stabbed to the body, but they wouldn't, Timothy Bradley wouldn't give him his credit, you know? Mm -hmm. uh, they figured it was Shakur. But Shakur fought a good fight, in and out. They, made, they, they broke a record today, coach. Less punches, right? Yep. Yeah. Forty punches landed in a in a twelve round fight. Hmm. Shit happens, man. <laughs> I'm with you on. I enjoyed it. I wish that maybe uh, a couple more combinations would have been thrown a little bit more. Yeah. Besides that, I enjoyed the fight myself. Yeah. How you have it scored? Both of them were a little spunky. I, I I think both of them was in shape, but nobody fading. And, and like they said, uh, Santos was. He, did, he was backing out, trying to bait Shakur in, mm -hmm. you know, kept him going out. But Shakur was just in and out, you know. That's Shakur. It was, it was a good fight to me. I like I like to see two fighters thinking and, and, and trying. Like, you know, it happens sometimes. Um. In your opinion, uh, oh, how'd you have it? How'd you have it scored? Not no unanimous decision. No. Did it, did it, was that a unanimous decision? Yeah. No, I was a little closer than that. Yeah. It, 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 neither fighter did a whole lot. You know what I mean? Mm. It should have been a majority decision. Mm. We got uh, Ingram, Ingram saying, uh, you know, he not a pay per view fighter. What you think? What you think, Coach? Um, Jahan Ingram said that. I, I, I agree. Not a, not a pay per view fighter. I, I agree. Because mm. he, he would he would have been on pay per view already by now, you know. Right. Did you hear that? Did you hear the crowd booing? Yeah. yeah. I think they was born for for the lack of action. Correct. You know. Correct. To the casual fans again, they don't know <laughs> clean boxing. When they sit, yeah, yeah, because see, I say I like boxing, but then I bring my family, and then my family going boo, right? right? All right. three of them, all four of them, right? Right, and you, you got two guys as sharp as they was. They, you can't do what you want. You can't do anything. You, you get caught. You know what I mean? So you got to think and move, and you know what I mean. Mm -hmm. As far as adjustments being made in the fight, when it comes to De La Santos, he had a lot to say at the end. Um, you know, he got that nickname Shakita Twitterson. Um, he gave him he gave him that like I think a couple of days ago, mm -hmm. and um, you know he said that he didn't come to fight. He's not a fighter. Um, what's your what's your behalf on that? Because like obviously he's a PBC fighter. He's a southpaw. He could punch, and I, it seems to me that this was kind of like all right for the heads to be to see you know how does that style match up with Shakur. And, you know, it's film out there now. Now there's film out there for you guys and for everybody when it comes to Shakur and the Southpaw uh, that punches. What do you think? Ralph, we don't need any film. We do, we do watch film, but we're going we to find a way. Um, I think Shakur is Shakur. You know, he had to make the adjustments to catch up with, with Shakur's style. You know what I mean? And right. He, but he failed to do it. I think when they were inside inside, I think he could have dropped in his knees more to create space in the hips so he could shoot under because he kept going over top. That's good. You know what I mean? Instructions. Kind of smothered himself. Should have dropped in his knees and found that inside space so he could shoot shots from the bottom. But he just could never make the adjustments, you know? And there was a lot of tying up between both of them. Yeah. Um um, other things as far as like what would you, what what would you also tell uh, Edwin uh, what to do a strategy to get him into the corners into the ropes uh, what what would you have to say I would have double triple the jab more mm -hmm. 
make because he would he would hop out once or twice. He said a double triple jab, get him to go to the ropes. Mm -hmm. He did it a few times, but then they would clinch. Mm -hmm. But he kept going over top till he got low and started from the bottom. You know what I mean? But it happens. You seen a lot of holes in Shakur's game tonight? I won't say holes, but he all fighters have flaws, you know. Mm -hmm. He was shocked and I don't like Shakur. He was shocked. Mm -hmm. He did what he's supposed to do. He got the L. Yeah, he, you know? he definitely got the, got the L. <laughs> uh, do you do you think that uh, his his uh, left hand was hurt? That's the reason why he wasn't throwing it, or do you think it was because the guy was powerful? And he didn't want to take chances. I just, I don't think it was. He said it wasn't bothering, but you know, even when it's not hurt, he don't do a whole lot of devastating punching with it. He just boxed the way he boxed, you know. Yeah. Better to fight with one with, with two hands than one, though, right? Yeah, it happens, man. You know, with the tank for one hand, he had to, you know, face the adversity. So if his hand was there, he did a good job with mm -hmm. one hand, you know? Mm -hmm. He did a good job with one hand. Uh, what type of criticism do you think that he will be getting after this fight? Oh, man. All kind of criticism. You know, the trolls, that, everything we do, the trolls jump on, man. You know, <laughs> they, tomorrow morning. It's gonna be hard. You see how he just left. He didn't even. He just left right away. Any criticism on both of them, but they, you know, they, they, they both for the a, a clean fight, strong fight from first to twelfth round. Mm. You know, both of them had pretty good footwork, so you really couldn't do what you wanted to do. You know, in and out, in and out. You know, it was, it was okay. It was okay. And sometimes it looked like it did look like they were shadow boxing a lot of misses, missing shots. You know what I mean? Yeah. Look like a, almost like a spawn session. Exactly, especially the first four yeah. rounds. You know. Yeah. Um. Strong and quick. You had, you had to be careful. You know. Right. Right. If if you had to like, just looking at Edwin De La Santos, um, even tonight, prior fights, in your behalf, is he an A level fighter by any means? Yeah. Yeah. I think so. Yeah. Give a lot of people problems in the division. Yeah, knock a lot of people out too. Right. Um, everybody don't move like Shakur, you know. Mm -hmm. I don't, don't move like Shakur, so he catch a lot of the guys that you know can't get away. See, what bothered me a lot was the straight lines moving back in the straight line. I think that that was, I was wondering, and then then leaving leaving your, your lead hand down while do it. I was I was wondering if if. Uh, Edwin De La Santa was gonna at least catch on to that by any right. means and they didn't read it. They didn't read it at all. Mm-hmm. Um